Flagpipe. The hell does that mean? Well, other than a literal flag on a pipe, it is a strategy that uses a combination of standard bearer vanguards and the operator bagpipe. Flag for the flag bearers and pipe for a, well, bagpipe. The reason she's needed specifically is because of her second talent, which jumpstarts all vanguards by giving them an additional 6 SP when deployed, including herself. The reason standard bearers are needed is their ability to print out more DP in a short amount of time compared to other vanguards. So, why is it good? The ability to generate a large, close to immediate amount of DP is valuable in general. You deploy some flag bearers down, and watch them go to work, and Bagpipe is there to help fend off early mobs. In theory, it is entirely possible to not have Bagpipe in the squad and save yourself a spot, but you wouldn't have that initial SP jumpstart, and the flag bearers themselves, without support, can't really fend off enemies and generate DP at the same time due to their trait. Or if you're using more than one flag bearer, you might have to deal with this national level mess. Once that DP is generated, you can practically deploy whoever else in the squad wherever and get your main strategy underway. As an example, you might have more expensive operators you want to put down early. Plot Myrtle down, activate the skill, deploy Bagpipe for early mobs, retreat Bagpipe when you have sufficient DP, stick down Blaze and watch them do their thing. And you still have Myrtle printing out DP for other operators down the line. Now, Flagpipe is not the be-all end-all vanguard strategy because there are some flaws. One of them is that depending on how many flag bearers you stick in your squad, that is space you can't use for other operators, taking up a minimum of two spots, which is not bad considering the setup, but maps that restrict squad space or demand the use of another operator to take up said flagpipe spots may say otherwise. The other issue has to do with maps that bum rush you immediately with mobs when you don't have the route to put down the standard flagpipe combo, as after that point you might be rushing the bum too hard and leak a bit. You know, enemies and not, uh, moving on. Not all rush bummy maps will punish flagpipe strategies, but some will overwhelm enough to do so. And that's basically flagpipe, an effective way to minimize your time spent on setting up your main defense. Something something, flags on pipes, myrtle on bagpipe action.